Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at Todoist versus Tick Tick and comparing them both to find out which one is the better task manager. Now by the end of this video you're going to understand everything you need to know about both of these tools and you'll be able to work out which one's a better fit for you. So let's start with an introduction. Todoist is a globally recognized task management app. It's trusted by over 100,000 organizations worldwide. Known for its proficiency in managing daily tasks and complex projects, it offers a variety of views including lists, Kanban and calendar. With robust task management features such as recurring due dates, task organization in sections, subtasks, email task creation and priority levels, Todoist stands as a comprehensive solution for task management. For TickTick, -tick, they embrace a minimalist theme with subdued colors and they offer a simple yet effective task management solution. Its broad cross-platform availability allows users to sync and manage tasks across multiple devices. With over 25 plus themes and the option to add a custom image, TickTick -tick provides greater flexibility in tailoring the app's appearance to your liking. Its simpler folder organization compared to Todoist makes it an easy to use tool for task management. So what are the key differences between them? To start with user interface. Todoist has a more professional and clean interface whereas TickTick -tick embraces a minimalistic theme with subdued colors. There's also differences in the task organization. Todoist allows for up to two subfolders per task folder, whereas TickTick -tick has simpler folder organization compared to Todoist. Next up, customization. TickTick -tick offers greater flexibility in tailoring the app's appearance to your liking with 25 plus themes and an option to add a custom image. And next up, task management features. Todoist has robust task management features, including recurring due dates, organizing tasks into sections, adding subtasks, creating tasks or adding comments via email, and setting priority levels. So what are Todoist's advantages when compared with TickTick? To start with global recognition. Todoist is used by over 100,000 organizations across the globe, which speaks volumes about its reliability and effectiveness. Next up is task management. It excels at managing daily tasks and is great for handling complex projects. This makes it a versatile tool suitable for a variety of users, from individuals managing their daily tasks to teams working on large projects. Next up, subfolders. Todoist allows for up to two subfolders per task folder, providing a greater level of organization for your tasks. Finally, robust features. Todoist has robust task management features, including recurring due dates, organizing tasks in sections, adding subtasks, creating tasks or adding comments via email, and setting priority levels. These features provide users with a comprehensive set of tools to manage their tasks effectively. So which one's better? Both Todoist and TickTick -tick have their own strengths and it really depends on your personal needs and preferences. Todoist is globally recognized and excels at managing daily tasks as well as complex projects. It offers a variety of views including lists, Kanban and calendars and has robust task management features. On the other hand, TickTick -tick embraces a minimalist theme and offers greater flexibility in tailoring the app's appearance. It also provides broad cross-platform availability. If you prefer a more professional and clean interface with robust task management features, Todoist might be a better choice. If you prefer a minimalist theme with more customization options, then TickTick -tick might be more suitable. Remember, the best way to decide is to try both apps and see which one fits your workflow better. So this has been my comparison video between Todoist and TickTick. -tick. Hopefully now that you've watched this video, you understand all the key differences between them and you should be able to work out which one's a better fit for you and your individual needs. I also hope you found this video helpful and if you did, please go ahead and comment down below to say this video helped you out and like and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching.